In this clip, I'm going to outline some of the ways I parlay my previous career in media practice and publishing into career development learning for our students. First up, I have a large number of contacts in the media and communication sector, and they keep me posted on industry changes, talk to our students at lectures and host our interns. Second, I use my experience of having juggled multiple careers to help teach our students how to stay agile in terms of employability. The scary but exciting truth is that many of our students will be applying for jobs that didn't exist when they first started their degrees. The takeaway is to put aside any pre-existing assumptions about what it means to work in journalism or PR or advertising or whatever and constantly scan the changing landscape gathering real-time information about what employers are looking for right now. Whenever possible, I demonstrate rather than lecture about key concepts. A couple of years back, I asked students in my industry transition course which celebrity would top their wish list as a special guest judge for our annual pitching competition. They nominated Osha host of Channel 10's The Bachelor, on account of his mental health advocacy work. Together we crafted a carefully worded pitch to Osher's agent, which successfully secured his involvement. We used similar approaches to secure other prestigious industry judges, including Annabelle Crabb. Afterwards, Osha talked up the competition winner on social media, tweeting that smart creative companies should be bombing her DMs with job offers before she was snaffled by someone else. My hope is that this set a great example for students in terms of the value of networking and of going after what you want, even if it seems like a bit of a long shot.